Hey, good morning. It's 9-11, Tuesday. Five days, six days before the trip, before I put it in the river. This is it. It's as much work as I'm going to do on it. Uh, we are actually going to put it in the water today at a local uh, lake that we have here. I am kind of concerned about the boat ramp, uh, if it's deep enough. Uh, it's a small, small little lake, pond, so uh, I'm going to take you around and show you some things that I did to the boat, and then uh, we're going to take it down there, put it in the lake, and see how it floats, and then we'll go from there. If it doesn't float right, I'm going to take the whole front of the pontoon structure off and just keep the back. And then maybe move it up. But it's going to delay the trip. Maybe a week. Maybe two. I don't know. Um, let's just see what happens. This is the back of the pontoon. And uh, what I've done is I've put a blue line of tape. And that is the halfway point. The tune is 24 inches deep. And 24 inches wide. And the bottom of the tape is 12 inches so when I put it in the water if the water goes up to that tape line then I'm still good if it goes way over that tape line then I just don't know what's gonna happen but we'll see you can see by the water line on the tune that it already sits that low I don't know, we just won't know what's going to happen until we get it in the water. This is some stuff here in the garage that I'm going to put on the boat. Trolling motor. Um, that bucket right there, there's a, there's a uh, propane tank in it. That I'm going to sit uh, on the front of the boat uh, on the port side to maybe help with the weight. And then this top one is a 5 gallon or 6 gallon water jug. Now I'm not going to take that with me because I have a 30 gallon in the truck or in the boat. But I wanted to take this just for the weight. And then uh, of course I have my tools. And then the green uh, tote down there is just full of boat stuff. And then the big tote right here has two gas cans in it. And uh, we're going to put it up on the front port side to kind of take up some of the weight so I'm gonna put this on the boat we're gonna to try to get it in the water and see what happens all right you're good Yeah, you can tell you're a little lower in the back, but it's not like drastic. You know what I mean? You can, you can tell you're a little lower in the back, but it's not like... It is drastic. Uh, it looks good. It's about two inches above that blue line. Send it to somebody. Does it? Does it? 
though. I'm saying it's 240. You want the iPod or the phone? Phone. There's 240 uh, gallons of fuel in it. All right, guys, we got it in the water, and I gotta say, I'm, I'm shocked. It's about an inch and a half, maybe two inches above the blue line, which is the middle part of the pontoon. And I think once I get some more weight up front here, that back will come up too. Plus, I have 240 gallons of fuel, which is or I mean 240 pounds of fuel on the back and I'll be burning that off too. We're going to take it for a little spin, see how, how it does. But I think it's sitting fine in the water. But please tell me what you guys think. Alright guys, we are in the water. The boat does sit at an angle a little bit. Not too bad. I'm going to try to get a shot of the tunes in the water without dropping the camera. so that'll take some weight off the back. I, I think we're good. See, I won't have these curtains there. Yeah. You're taking those off? Um, I might, and then just pin them up at night. Right. I think this will get me out of the way of a, a barge. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. See, that little uh, five-gallon bucket there, I have a propane tank in. Then that green tote is my two gas cans, two extra gas cans. And... Uh, over here is a um, just a tote full of boat stuff that um, 
that I'll need throughout the trip. I think it's sitting really well. We could even put more weight in the back if we have to. I think it's going to work really well. And I have it insured out the hilt, so if anything happens, <laughs> we're insured. Alright, we're going to see if we can't put it back on the trailer. Yeah. 